Hey, Zim. What's going on, Zim? Hey, Zim. Hey, Ryan. Hey, Ryan. What's up, Zim? Just want to tell you congratulations on being the first ever national to get his number retired. Pretty fitting that you were the first ever Nationals draft pick and also the first ever national to get his number retired, man. Couldn't happen a better person. Hey, Zim. Uh, it's Sean, your old teammate from Virginia and the Nats. I just want to say congrats on getting your number retired. Congrats on an amazing career. I hope you enjoy the weekend. Uh, you absolutely deserve it for everything that you've done uh, in a Nationals uniform. Uh, so good job, number 11. You finally retired. Uh, first off, congratulations. And uh, I wanted to personally say thank you for being the same individual from when I was first drafted to you guys in uh, 2011. And uh, it was a long time coming, but we finally got to uh, jump into each other's arms in 2019 like little kids. And uh, that's a memory that I definitely won't ever forget. So congratulations to you and the family. I'm happy for you. Uh, thanks you. Thank you a lot for everything that you've done for me, for my teammates, and for this organization. Uh, you're a legend and you're always going to be part of this team for me and for all my teammates. Thank you very much and uh, enjoy your retirement, World Series champ. I just want to tell you congratulations. Well deserved um, retirement and retiring of, of number 11. It finally happened. Just want to say congrats on your retirement day. You had a heck of a career. I uh, love playing with you for all those years. And uh, my favorite memory is definitely pouring champagne in your eyes after we won the World Series. Congratulations on getting your number retired. Uh, no better national to have his, his number retired than you. Congratulations on an unbelievable career. Um, getting your jersey retired, I know it's a great honor for you. and. Uh, Congratulations on a, a, a tribute weekend. I'm sure you're super pumped about that. Um, it was an absolute honor and a pleasure to getting to win a World Series with you and um, getting to share the field with you. I knew when you started out, you were gonna have a heck of a career. You made this game look easy. Congratulations on your weekend, man. You must be a bad dude to have a whole weekend. Most people would just have a day. But uh, hey, you deserve it. Uh, I remember when you first broke in, um, Boy, you've been a heck of a player, had a, had a tremendous career. Happy retirement and congratulations on getting your number retired first ever. Uh, it doesn't surprise me you were uh, our leader and our captain for, you know, so many, so many years. And it was a pleasure playing with you, so, um, you know, I'll never forget it. In all of my sports casting career, I loved covering players like you because it was never about you. Heavens, the first draft choice of the Washington Nationals franchise, You've played in more games, you've scored more runs, you've hit more home runs, you've simply done it all. Hey Rhino, I just want to send my congratulations. No one is more deserving. From the moment I walked in that Nationals Cup clubhouse in 2012, everyone knew who the guy was, right? You are everything that's right in the game, you are everything that is right when a franchise drafts a player. Congratulations on your amazing career. As an avid baseball fan, Thank you so much for the joy and excitement you brought me during your 16 years with the Nats. Your feats on and off the field have been extraordinary. Hi Ryan, Grandpa Zim here. We want to congratulate you on your having your number retired by the Nationals. It's what a great, great honor. Your career has been a long one and your grandma and I certainly enjoyed watching you progress up through the ranks of the skill levels and traveling to, to watch you in different areas. None, however, can top your playing with the Nats when they won the World Series. It is great to see you retire on your terms, uh, but we're certainly anxious to see what goes, what is next. Grandma and Grandpa love you very much. And we are very proud of not only your accomplishments, but we're proud of who you are. Love you. Bye now.